I'm here at the Supercomputing Show in Austin, Texas, and this brings together a lot of the leading experts in high performance computing. Both hardware vendors and software vendors and engineers and scientists come here to find out the newest things in supercomputing and high performance computing. And we're showing a range of demos from hard science, astrophysics, all the way down to geographic information system packages that urban planners use every day. Today we're launching the personal supercomputer, and this is a product for engineers and scientists that gives them the power of a supercomputer in a PC-based workstation. Previously, could not have done this before. So they can take applications that previously had to be deployed on clusters. Just, you're chained to that cluster, and now we can take that application and move it into a standard PC-based workstation that lives in your office, plugs into the wall, and is your own personal resource for supercomputing. Engineers and scientists using the personal supercomputer can program directly in the C language. They can write their problem in languages and tools that they know. So it's nothing unfamiliar. And that means they can take problems and put them directly on the personal supercomputer and solve them very quickly, much like they do on clusters today. The personal supercomputer is available from resellers worldwide, from large worldwide suppliers down to local suppliers who will build machines exactly the way you want them and exactly for your research. The Tesla personal supercomputer is a new category of PC-based workstation. It's a standard PC-based workstation, but we've done something special to it. We've added Tesla processor boards, up to four processor boards, with 3.732 teraflops of computing power inside a standard chassis. With 960 cores, under $10,000, is going to revolutionize the capability of engineers and scientists in supercomputing.